podcast. I'm Jeffrey Bishop, and I'm here with Reese Coleman. Who is your, who's just the owner? You want to introduce to our little friend we have here? We I have no name for him, but it's a little uh, cacti for oh, some reason. I don't know where we got it, but B Bunny Howard has it. Uh, yeah. Okay. We're back. Then took a little break. I don't know why, but we took a little break. We took a little break because uh, two weeks prior to this video, there was a large snowstorm. Oh yeah, that's yeah, all that uh, longness of what comes with snowstorms. So we didn't have school. It was nice. It was nice. But anyways, uh, Valentine's Day is coming up, as you guys may know. Everyone, get your Valentine's something special. Yeah, and if you have a Valentine's Day box in the classrooms, make some Valentine's card for the people at the retirement homes and for the people around school. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Do you have Valentine? I do not. What about you, Jeffrey? No, I don't. What is that? Nobody wants to be my Valentine. What is that? I don't know. I'm just, no one don't love me. That's false, man. You get the bros. It's okay. Thanks, man. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. Oh. Well, recently, uh, the girls' basketball team has won SFC for the second time in a row. They played the Midford Falcons. They got to win out, though. They beat Medford to tie for SOC. So if they win out, which is they play like three more games, if they win out, then they won SOC for two years in a row. And like, that's like in the first time ever in school history. How did they win it out? I thought they tied it. They did tie it. But if they win, like, if one of them loses a game, then they lose the tie. Like, they lose the trophy. We're still an SOC player, aren't we? Yeah. That's what I thought. So if. If we went out and Memphis went out, they have to share the trophy. Mm. But if one of them loses, another person, another team wins. Well, for today's day, who's the girls to play today? Is that Trace? Peebles. Peebles? Mm. Our way. Mm. You going to that game tonight? Nope. I'm not either. I'm going to go <laughs> pump some iron, dude. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Pump some iron. <laughs> That's how you were say. <laughs> pump some iron, dude. Since Valentine's coming up, uh, also, that means closer to graduation. Sadly, we will not be making videos here in about uh, four months, three yeah. months. So, no more videos, no more TWP. Someone's gonna, have, someone else is gonna have to carry the torch. Yep. So as that comes along, us seniors is gonna have a little game. It's called Senior Assassin. The seniors did it last year. It's like we don't know if we'll do the same game they did last year, but this is a fun senior games we'll have. So. Um, I'm sure you guys all saw it, like it was on TikTok, it was big on TikTok, everyone was watching them and doing them, so. The rules are, you have to wear goggles, you can't wear goggles in school obviously, but you have to wear goggles outside anywhere in a public place, and they will track you down and shoot you with a water gun, and that's how you get eliminated in senior status, and everyone's given a random target as a senior, and once you eliminate your target, then you move on to another target, but if you kill your target with a water gun, then you're safe. But make sure you're always wearing your little swim goggles. Swim goggles, yep. All right, we're gonna play a little game here. What kind of game? Uh, little little restaurant review for you guys. I don't know what you guys usually like to eat on a daily basis, but we have. Yeah, do you guys like going out to eat? Cause I like going out to eat. I eat out every day. Yeah. And here's about uh, Taco Bell. Taco Bell is the number one place I eat out, especially after the meeting. All right, well, here's the top 10 restaurants you did not want to eat at. Chicken Flame is on there. Because they're unhealthy. Top 10 unhealthiest fast food restaurants of 2024. 20, from 2023 to 2024 now. So number 10, Chick-fil-A. I literally just said that. <laughs> Is it number 10? Yeah, it's at number 10. How is that unhealthy? It's literally just chicken. I don't know. I thought Chick-fil-A was a very nice business. It's great food. Why is it that? I don't know. It says the average dinner meal, including drink, is over 1,600 calories. Well, as a, as a high school student trying to gain more muscle mass, I would think that would be better. I don't know. I think that would be good to have enough calories for that. Mm -hmm. My pleasure. What, what do you like, like to get at Chick-fil-A? Uh, just 
chicken sandwich and fries, waffle fries, and French. What else? That's pretty much it. What I else? Almost get, sometimes get the chicken nuggets, dino nuggets. Oh, you would. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I, I don't eat diamond nuggets anymore. So. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> I, yeah, I, I don't favor diamond nuggets anymore. <laughs> Why'd you say that? Dino what? nuggets. <laughs> dino nuggets. <laughs> Sit that thing down. Yeah. Sit it down. Okay, we're done with this. <laughs> okay. Anyways, well, whenever I used to go to uh, Chick Fil A in Nashville, I usually get like the twenty piece chicken. Oh, so, yeah, I get a little hungry. So. I see videos of like people buy a bunch of chicken nuggets, then mac and cheese, mm -hmm. then waffle yeah. fries, and buffalo special. sauce and ranch, and they make they mix like a free, like a whole like um, <laughs> <bowl>. <laughs> like a whole like. The yeah, I know what you mean. They, have, they bring their own little tub and they put mac and cheese and all that stupid stuff in there. They have yeah. the fries. Yeah, I saw it on TikTok the other day. They have like the most like absurd stuff in it. It's like honey mustard. Yeah, yeah. But I never had honey mustard from Chick Fil A, so I don't know how it tastes. Probably like honey mustard. It's different though. <laughs> all right, but it's on. literally different. <laughs> literally, all the restaurant like barbecue sauce from Wendy's is not the same barbecue sauce from McDonald's. Tastes like barbecue sauce to me. Maybe you're just bland. Okay. <laughs> Keep going. All right, number nine. Little Caesars. Little Caesars. I can see that being unhealthy. Yeah. Especially that crazy bread, all that garlic and cheese and all that. Yeah, I'm not really a Little Caesars guy. I like the little uh, crazy breads that you can get for like five dollars. I used to be on a crazy bread crave. Yeah. Right after, you know, pull out of the gym, pull up the Little Caesars in that porch one. Get the eye, the guy asking you for money. You were done oh with yeah. Mm -hmm. Where you trying to eat? Knock on the window. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, this is the best guy. Well, this place, it's not around where we're from, but it's called Smash Burgers. Smash Burgers. Never heard of that place, to be honest with you. Wow, well, I used to watch Mike Manjack. You know who that is? Mike Manjack? No. You know who that is? He used to hang out with Logan Paul, but he does like this burger show. Oh, yeah, I know that is. Okay. Yeah, he had this burger show I used to watch. Number seven. Big time. <laughs> 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 there were seven McDonald's. <laughs> McDonald's. Mickey D's. I also like to get two nuggets from McDonald's. I like the big chickens from McDonald's. You too, man. They're pretty hard. It's lit. <laughs> uh, I'm actually a. Uh, I usually do get the chicken nuggets, but I like the. What's it called? Big Macs? Yeah. Yeah. I usually get the Big Macs, get the five dollar buy one get one. Mm -hmm. That's Max. But uh, skip down to number one. I don't know what number one is. All right, well, let's go down the list real quick. Number six is Quiznos. What's Quiznos? I don't know what that is. Anyways, um, <laughs> number five, KFC. <laughs> KFC. Number four, Dairy Queen. She's sitting around me. My fault. Okay. No, I don't, don't worry. Now the top three. Don't worry. Taco Bell at number three. How is that bad for you? I don't know. Much protein, beans, good in fiber. And how often do you eat Taco Bell on a daily basis? Probably not like a daily basis, but like a week. I probably eat Taco Bell once a week, every weekend. Every on weekend? On a Saturday night at like 3 o'clock in the morning. It sounds a little too familiar. I think I've been on those runs before. All right, number two, Sonic, which I don't. I've, I've never seen really, Sonic. I don't know Sonic either. Personally, our Portsmouth Sonic is slower than a turtle, so we never go there. And coming at number one, Jim Rule. Here, I got you. <laughs> okay, what is it? At number one, <laughs> Wendy's. Really? You know, tell Ms. Schmidt that. Ms. Schmidt, I told the Wendy's. Bunch of calories in at Wendy's. Really? Yes. Yeah. What do you usually get at Wendy's? I normally just get uh, the nuggets. I always get a 10 piece nugget and bacon and fries. Just kind of. Bacon and fries? 
That's not bad. Yeah. I mean, I pref- what would you prefer, Wendy's or McDonald's? McDonald's. But if I would have to eat one of them, probably McDonald's. Do you think Wendy's is cheaper than McDonald's, or do you think McDonald's is cheaper than Wendy's? McDonald's is cheaper than Wendy's, I'm pretty sure. I don't know, but... Uh, I don't know. I couldn't tell you. But I like their fries better. That's how I like to eat. Yeah. I like Wendy's fries a lot better than McDonald's fries. I don't know, I can't. Both their fries are kind of mad. But nah, but the barbecue sauce is definitely different at Wendy's than it is at McDonald's. Yeah, I know. I was just giving you a hard time. Yeah, you, you're yeah. trying to trigger that uh, little short anger response, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah, that's right. All right, we're going to play a little game here. What's the game? Uh, we, need tr- we need to try to name as much things as we're possible. We're going to try to name 10 animals. To start with the letter, Mr. Howard, give us a letter. Ready? Yes. Put, put two. Get, get that timer on there. I'm gonna get the timer on here. They got, they got to be at least ten animals that have that letter in their name. Though. I know, but I don't want to be like. Um. Uh, Happy Bora. All right, we. I don't know any of the animals. Give us an easy letter. All right, please. Mr. Howard's gonna give us a letter. And we're going to come up with 10 animals that start with that letter in two minutes. L. L. The word, the letter is L. Are we both doing it at the same time? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. L. Um, Three, two, one. Lemur. Lemur. Llama. Lizard. Lizard. Uh. Uh. I'm already done. Uh. Uh. A lamb. Lamb. Yes. Labradoodle. <laughs> That's a go. Go on, Reese. That's a go. Okay, okay, five. Uh, 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 a no. lamb. Did you ever say that? That's a Labradoodle, yeah. Oh. Uh, it's five. Okay. Mm. Um, uh, did I ever say lemur? Luis? I said lemur. I said lemur. Um, I don't know. <laughs> There's only five though. Uh, lay, lay, la, You say lizard? <laughs> yes, this is lizard. Um, is Lazarus an animal? Isn't that, isn't that like a name? <laughs> oh, it's not a name. <laughs> I thought it was a name. <laughs> um, We're running out of time. We're getting a minute left. Uh, le, la. Uh, I don't know. Allah. He gave us a hard one. What am I missing that's so common? Allah. Mm-hmm. Wait. Did you say llama? Yeah, I did. Mm-hmm. A leaper? Is leaper? A leaper. Leaper. We got a leaper. That's six. That's a leaper. You don't know who a leaper is? He's distracted. Yeah, he is. We have 29 seconds. La, 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 la. Uh, <laughs> go look at him for uh, Lamborghini. Oh, yeah. We've lost. Lion. Leopard. <laughs> Isn't that what you were trying to say? Yeah. Ladybug. <laughs> what was that, nine? Lobster. <laughs> a lion. <laughs> it's leatherback sea turtle. <laughs> oh, it looks uh, like we won. We won that one. <laughs> we, can, we can try it again. We just, uh, we won't cheat this time. What did you say? What did you say? The ammo was a leaper. A leaper, yeah. It's L E P E R. Leaper. That's leper. It looked up leprosy. Which is a disease. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we were wrong. Leaper. Don't worry. Yeah, that's what I meant. Yeah. Look at the animals. <coughs> Look at the animals. Oh, man. Okay, it's, it's it's a thing of a Call of Duty. <laughs> so, it's also a Warframe. Oh, Warframe. Right. I don't even know what Warframe is. Yeah. Alright, well, we I don't know what Warframe is. is. I, I play I Warframe. I know that game. I used, to, I used to play that game. What's Warframe? It's like, it's kind of like, I don't know. It's like a. It's kind of like, how would you compare Warframe to? It's like Destiny. Yeah, it kinda, it's kind of like Destiny. Really? Yeah. yeah. You get to ride. You get to ride spaceships in space and like travel to other people's worlds and stuff like that. 
Okay. Sounds like a very interesting game. I might have to buy it. And play. <laughs> well, it's free to play on Xbox. It's free. Four. It's free to play on Xbox. Xbox One or Three Sixty. I'm gonna Xbox One. Okay. All right, we're gonna play. We're gonna play some. Uh, we're gonna play one more game because that game was so fun, guys. <laughs> yeah, it was very fun. Using our brains a little bit. This is called Hot and Cold. It got to be in this room. Or else I ain't never gonna make it. Yes, you, you'll be able to get some. That'd be easy. It will. Hot and cold game. So he, I'm gonna think of something in my head. He has to try and guess it. If he gets close, I'm gonna say hot. And if he's not close, he's say cold. And he'll eventually get it. And I'll, if he needs, and I'll help him out on the way. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's get let's get into it. I already got it in my head. What is it? Let's come up with something. <laughs> Okay, is it on a school building? No, but it can be on a certain day. On a certain day. Is it shoes? No. Is it clothing? No. Is it a pencil? As soon as you guess it, you'll know what I'm talking about. Okay, do you use it on a daily basis? Is you don't use it. You don't use it? You don't use it. You said it's an object. It could be anything, like... Clothing, cars, food, drinks, like something like that. Do you consume it? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Don't turn that on. Don't turn that on. <laughs> okay, what is that? What is that? I can't tell you what it is. You're, you act like you consume it. All right, you're warm. You're warm. Yes. It's yummy. <laughs> I mean, it depends if you like it or not. <laughs> what do you do? You make it in the morning? Is it a breakfast food? No. Is it evening? It can be, yeah. Is it a drink? No. Is it actually? Yes. Okay. Is it protein? You're warm. Really warm. Okay, so the what is it? Chicken? You're very warm. Extremely warm, like boiling <laughs> hot water chicken. warm. Yeah. It's chicken. Yes, but there's some in front of chicken. Right. Come on, I'm gonna play it out. Fried chicken. What you working with, Grace? Oh, stop. <laughs> stop. <laughs> stop. <laughs> It's chicken, but what what goes in front of fried chicken? <laughs> <laughs> no. I, I said, said it. I said it in the early of the video. What? Oh. Chicken nuggets. Extremely like lava warm. <laughs> Dino nuggets. Yeah. Dino nuggets. Dino nuggets. I hate Dino nuggets. Reese loves Dino nuggets. Reese loves Dino Nuggets. <laughs> you're very funny. You think you're funny? Oh, all right. You think you're funny? Okay. Well, let's, let's Let me. No, it's my turn. Oh, well, I think the camera's gonna die. I don't care. The camera's gonna die. I don't care. All right. Let's get our let's get our outro in before the camera dies first. All right. Well, we're going to wrap things up on this video. Thank you for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and comment if you have any ideas you want us to do. We might do it. And um, I'm Jeff Bishop, and I'm out. <laughs>